Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy, I'm Nick Arg here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a great day or night so far. In today's video, I'm going to be basically summarizing all the Fortnite news that you missed throughout today and through yesterday. So hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you guys are new to my channel and don't know why, do I keep you guys up to date with everything regarding Fortnite news? And with season 10 just starting and throughout season 10, you will not be disappointed by subscribing. I'd love to have you on this channel as well. And with all that said, I'm going to explain one more thing real quick that's making these type of videos different from the other people that make them. So basically, if you guys want to come for only one topic i'm going to leave a timestamp in the description or in the pinned comment below that you can actually go to to get to that one topic so i'm going to leave that in there if you guys want to go check it out you always can but the first thing i want to discuss is today's item shop so in today's item shop, it's really not that bad. We got a new back bling, a new wrap, and as well as a new emote. If you guys want to support me in the item shop, my supporter creator code is I'm Nick Argo, no spaces. I really never advertise that anymore, but if you guys want to support me, you always can. If you end up supporting me, make sure you send me a video or picture of on Twitter, Instagram, or Discord, because I'm going to start featuring them in my videos, and I really appreciate it. So without further ado, now I'm going to get into the first topic of the video, and that's going to be Renegade Raider. Yes, Renegade Raider. I know we say this every season, but this is possibly going to be returning within season 10 so it says this hi nate thanks for thanks for your time contacting us the renegade raider was available for purchase through the season shop now known as the item shop for 1200 v bucks to purchase you had to reach season level 20 it was first available during september and ended around november 2017 renegade raider will be added to the item shop at some point unfortunately for season one players the item shop skin will have a new variant when the original variant of the skin will remain exclusive the game developer has recently added an additional style for this skin, and this style will most likely be exclusive as well. Epic Games values your feedback, and I would love to recommend you file in-game co comments since those directly go to Epic Development Team. This will make sure that your voice gets heard by the people in charge of making changes to the game. This is by an Epic employee, by the way. So he basically confirms that the Renegade Raider might be coming back this season. But that's why I know they say this every season, but this is a good chance it's coming back. So that topic was pretty crazy, but now let's get right into the next one. We gotta move on. It's going to be there should be a new Rift event possibly happening. Fort Tory posted this Rift Beacon threat. So a Rift Beacon got added to the files. It has connections with Nexus Rift Zero Point, and it has sounds in the Athena slash event file, which basically means there is a high chance for this to come to Battle Royale. As you can see on the screen right now, here's what it looks like, and this thing looks crazy. And as you can see, we're going through the pictures. There's a little Rift thing or a Zero Point Zone, whatever you want to call it and it's around Neo Tilted this time. So sadly, that's all the information we know about this topic so far. I'll keep you guys up to date as we get more information. The next one I have for you guys, there's going to be old point of interest returning back to the Fortnite map throughout Season 10. How we know this is by little Easter eggs around the map. I know a lot of people are covering this recently. I want to cover it anyway, even though it's a couple days late. But you can see on screen right now, there's Moisty Myers Tree. There's a Flush Factory Toilet. There's a Risky Girl sign as well as the Whiteboard. And as well, there's a Lazy Links Golf like Course sign, whatever you want to call it. And as well, in that building, there's like a whole lazy links golf clubs everything like that so i love that idea of old pois coming back i want you to let me know down in the comments if you could have one point of interest out of boisty meyer flush factory risky reels or lazy links one location what would it be let me know down in the comments your thoughts on that so let's get right into the next topic so this topic actually regards the meteor. So Crispy Leaks posted this. A telescope has appeared at the top of a building investigating the meteor. So you can see on screen right now, here's what it looks like. And a telescope is actually looking at the meteor. I don't know what this means. You guys can speculate for yourself, figure out what it means. But I'll move on to the next topic and that's going to be Dusty Depot is going to have stages and we are currently at the second stage of Dusty Depot. I know it sounds weird. So Tiger Hyper posted this on a Twitter, another great leaker. He said HD pictures of the next stage of Dust. You can see on screen right now, here are the pictures. And I like how they're doing this. They're adding like stages to it. They're taking stuff away, adding stuff to it. I like that a lot. Under that, he said there are four stages of Dusty. Currently, we are on the second stage and this leak is for stage three. He actually posted the last stage. As you can see on screen right now, he said this leak. Few HD pics for the last stage of the Dusty building. Probably the Rift Beacon is being built here. So this this actually goes back to a topic that I previously made a couple minutes ago about the Rift Beacon. So he thinks that in Dusty is where they're going to be building this Rift Beacon. 
So that's honestly an insane topic, but now let's get right into the last one, and that's going to be the Spray and Pray challenges. What these are is going to be the Week 2 challenge. If you guys remember, in the previous seasons, we had Week 1, Week 2, Week 3, and Week 4, etc. But in this season, we're basically going to have weekly challenges, but they're going to be called a different thing every time. And these are going to be the Week 2 challenges. You can see on screen right now, here's what they look like in-game with the icon, and here's what they actually are. I'm not going to read out every single one. There's no point in me doing that, but that's what at the end of the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching. Because it's my first time doing a video like this, and I appreciate you for making it to the end. If you guys did enjoy this video and I showed you guys new information and new stuff you didn't know before, make sure you drop a like on the video. Let me know down in the comments. Do you think that I should do these type of videos or each topic individually? Let me know your thoughts on that down in the comments. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. You will not be disappointed with the content that I already offer you guys. I'll, I'll love to have you on this channel as well. Have a great rest of your day or night. Use code Omnic Argon Item Shop to support me, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow with a couple of brand new uploads. And I cannot wait to see you guys there. Peace.